Hey you guys, it's P, the Sagittarian Goddess. If you're new, go ahead and subscribe. And if you're returning, welcome back. Well, I am continuing my Sun Sign series. I've made it to Cancer. Before I get started, I want to show y'all my shirt. And Cancer is right here. Isn't she lovely? And I love the cutouts in front of it. <clears throat> and the back is regular. Anyway, y'all, I had to show y'all that because this, this shirt is so cute. When I saw it, I was like, yes, I gotta get it. This video is all about the Cancer Sun or if you have your sun in your fourth house. So if you're interested in learning more about personality traits and some of the blind spots of the Cancer Sun, then stay tuned. Cancer is a water sign and Cancer is ruled by the moon. I love the moon. Who doesn't love looking at the moon, right? Who doesn't love how the moon sits so beautifully in the sky? If you don't, you're, you're watching the wrong video because this is about Cancer. And the moon rules over Cancer. Cancer is a very emotional sign. The body parts that Cancer rules over is the chest, the breast, and the belly. The moon in astrology represents our emotions. The moon is home for Cancer. When I think about the Cancer sun or the sun in the fourth house person, they are naturally nurturing. And what I've what I've discovered being around a few cancers that are very, very close to me is that they are very nurturing in a in a practical way. Um, they can be very nurturing practically. They are very, very caring and sympathetic towards other people. The cancer son and the son and the fourth house person cares a lot about how other people feel. So if the sun in astrology represents your ego and cancer is here, you can only imagine, you can only imagine the nurturing nature of the cancer moon. The cancer sun and the sun in the fourth house person cares very deeply about their comfort and the comfort of others. And this comfort is physical and emotional. The cancer sun loves to be comfortable especially emotionally and physically. The Cancer Sun's home could be very home-like, very cozy. The Cancer Sun can invest a lot into their home and the essentials that they use often around their home. They will keep things stocked up in their home. They will, they will make sure that they don't have a chance of like running out of things maybe not every every cancer sun because everyone is different but most cancer suns or sun in the fourth house people they like to stay in stock with all their essential needs especially in their home because they like to have things together in their home they don't like to have to run out last minute to get something that they could have got in bulk and the cancer sun can spend a lot of time at home like not saying that they don't have a social life or they don't go out and, you know, go to different places and try new things. But the Cancer feels most comfortable at home regardless of how many activities that they indulge in. Regardless of how many friends they have, how, many, how much they hang out with other people. Their home is very, very special to them on a different level. Cancer is the mother figure of the zodiac regardless of um male or female the cancer is still like the mother of the zodiac and as a mother you know you feel as a mother especially a new mother uh just giving birth a new mother just giving birth for example she's going to feel more comfortable in the comfort of her home with her baby and that is how the cancer relates to their home environment it's very it's very sentimental the cancer sun is going to take care of it they're going to do their best to take care of that space 
bouncing off of that point the cancer sun or the sun in the fourth house person you can have a hard time trying to get them to leave their house when they don't put their pajamas on put their lingerie on they they box the drawers on or whatever it's hard to get them to leave the house I'm not saying that they won't if it's an emergency but the cancer sun and the sun in the fourth house person they value their comfort and once they get comfortable after a long days of work or chores or uh, spending time with family friends children they're ready to unwind and once they unwind it's like it, it most likely needs to be an emergency for them to get up out of bed. The sun and the fourth house person, they're loyal to their comforts. The cancer sun and the sun and the fourth house person cares deeply, deeply, deeply about the connections they have with their family. Cancer is gifted when it comes to taking care of others. They are the caregivers of the zodiac. The Cancer, depending on how their chart is and where their Mercury and Mars is, but the Cancer can have um, a different way of showing that they care outside of verbal expression. They may not show a lot of verbal expression, but they will be hands-on with things. They will <clears throat> provide things. It can be easier for the Cancer Sun or the Sun in the fourth house person to show that they care for someone just by doing something for them. They are definitely the types of people that will give you a warm place to stay. They are good at helping others survive in the practical world. They are extremely quick to show someone how to better take care of themselves and they often don't mind helping out financially when they see that someone is truly in need. I really, really love the cancer energy. When a loved one is sick, um, like physically ill, the cancer son or the son in the fourth house person, they may be one of the first ones to offer help and support. The cancer son can tend to be the will be like the first one in the family to say, hey, you know, I'll you know, I'll step up and, you know, take care of this and that. The cancer has a really, really, um, really generous nature about nurturing and taking care of other people. And that's very, very beautiful because the cancer son is naturally helpful to others. Not saying that the other signs, <clears throat> that the other zodiac signs aren't helpful and nurturing because every sign is nurturing and helpful in their own way. But the cancer, but the cancer is naturally drawn to take care. The cancer son or the son in the fourth house person can be so naturally drawn to take care of other people that they often are the ones who forget about themselves. It's so important for the cancer son to say yes to themselves the very same way that they say yes to others. The cancer is very protective over its family. In particular, the cancer son can be very, very protective over its children and its spouse or, you know, partner. Also, the cancer son and the son in the fourth house person can be quite moody because you have to remember the moon that rules over cancer goes through phases. So you can imagine the phases that the cancer sun, any placement with cancer is going to correlate with the phases of the moon. And that is change. So the cancer can be quite moody. It's vital for the cancer to be very knowledgeable of its emotions. Cancer is very emotional. So when the Cancer is making friends, they potentially see them as family members. They can have a very, very strong love for their friends. They could see them as their family or see them as their extended family. Last point that I want to make regarding the Cancer's mood changes. Be very, very aware, Cancer, of 
your emotional state, um, how you react towards others and to your and towards yourself when you're in these emotional states, whether it's happy, sad, but in particular when they're negative emotions. Because these similar to Gemini, because this is fourth house and we're coming from the third house, which is Gemini. And so you could be quite unaware, similar to Gemini, of your mood changes. Probably not as much as the Gemini, but you could be unaware of how your mood change is affecting your loved ones and even the energy surrounding yourself, your aura, your energy. So I hope you all enjoyed this video on the Cancer Sun and the Sun in the fourth house. Go ahead and subscribe. I appreciate y'all for watching. And if you hung out through this video, drop me a comment down below. Let me know how this video resonated with you. Do you know a Cancer? Are you a Cancer? Like what is one of your most biggest challenges that you have as a cancer son or a son in the fourth house and what is something that you love about yourself drop me a comment down below i will see you all in the next video